guys i wanted to do a quick um video this really isn't a review i guess it's more like my experience with these products that i have been using since i want to say november and just comparing the two products again just my personal experience so today i am talking about hopefully i am in focus i'm going to talk about noxema i call it noxema but that's not how you say it noxema classic clean moisturizing cleanser and the classic clean original deep cleansing cream both of them were sold at um or are sold at what's that place called bed bath and beyond i didn't even know they had like an entire beauty section over there i was looking for a meat thermometer <laughs> and i was walking around and i seen this and i had been wanting to pick this up so oh i hope i'm not blurry but yeah i just wanted to try it so i got the moisturizing one first and then i got the original after i used this entire thing up both of them are like i want to say five dollars at the most well, six dollars at the most five dollars because of tax and whatnot um you can find this at walmart target bed bath and beyond cvs walgreens family dollar dollar general dollar store probably like you can find probably find it at family dollar better than the rest of them but yeah uh this one you can tell that this one is moisturizing just by the feel of it before you even apply it to your face like it just has that extra creamy texture to it so i have to get out the mindset thinking that since i have oily skin i can't use products that have more moisture or are um, kind of oily because some oil i mean is good for oily skin and kind of like not com combats oil but it kind of um that's what I'm looking for. I guess it lessens the oil production. That's the only thing I could think of. So this one was good. I did see my skin clearing up. I'm not. Obviously, I have a full face on. I just did a tutorial. But um, I did. It really isn't about my skin. It's just my experience. So this one, you can definitely tell that this has more, um, more of a creamier texture. It's smoother. Is softer but it kind of burned a little bit more if you haven't tried noxema it has like this tingling it says tingles and refreshes because of the eucalyptus in it but I mean that only says on the classic clean the moisturizing cleansing cream it says it has soy in it either way this one kind of tingled a little bit rougher than the original one, which I thought this would be a little bit too dry for my skin. Um, but this one kind of burned. Not in a bad way, but when it tingles, I just feel like, okay, it's getting deep down in my pores like it's supposed to. But this one definitely tingled a little bit stronger than this one. So, yeah, if you have sensitive skin, the original one might be better for you i don't know again that's just my experience this was a little rough on my skin but this either way i still feel clean but the classic clean is a little bit milder feeling like i could feel the tangle but it's not as strong which is great because i don't like my beauty regimen being painful even though beauty is pain but how about no you know what else? Um, both of these are 12 ounces. 45% mm, less plastic in the container, which is great. The Noxema says tingles and refreshes for soft, smooth skin with eucalyptus. And the moisturizing says deep cleanse and moisturizes for soft, hydrated skin with moisturizing soy. So, yeah. I don't know. I think if I bought this again, I'm going to go ahead and get the original um, just because I feel like it it feels better for my skin. I'm not going to say it works better, but it feels better because either way, my skin is extremely clean, deep, poor, 
clean, refreshed everything with either one, but I just like this one better. It's dermatologist tested. Ingredients, I'm just looking at the ingredients. They have the same ingredients, um, just some differences, not many. Like maybe like five ingredient differences. But other than that, they are still basically the same, just one is more moisturizing and supposedly, I mean to flick you off, but supposed, supposedly smoother. Um, but yeah, I personally like the classic clean. Also, I went ahead and bought the Noxzema Ultimate Clear Anti-Blemish Pads. And it's supposed to clear and prevent breakouts. Now, you can't see it, but um, I'm having a breakout on my chin right now. It's hormonal, so it's really nothing I can do with it. I feel like my hormonal acne it takes its precious time getting off of my face no matter what products i use i could use noxema day and night i can use mario badesky products day and night i can use um what's that man peter thomas roth with his expensive behind i can use that day and night my hormonal acne moves at its own pace and clears up at its own pace so it's just something i'm starting to deal with and just come to realize that Many products are not going to clear that up, so yeah, sadly, but I do see that the anti-blemish pads does help somewhat with kind of drying it out a little bit quicker, but I can still like wipe my finger around my chin and it's still there, so yeah. If you don't know what this looks like, I'll go ahead and show you. <laughs> So, yes, it definitely smells like eucalyptus. Um, it's not a strong scent to me. Other people say it's too strong for them. Like, my mom is sensitive to it. Like, she said she used to use it when, um, and I used the whole thing it is. She used to use it when she was, um, my age or whatever. But she has really bad asthma. So, she, it makes her feel windy, like it's too strong. So, yeah. And then here is one pad. You get 90 pads for like $4, which is really good. This like paper thing. And I also feel like it has like these um, like little rough parts in the pad. Kind of like exfoliating the dead skin as well as clearing up the blemishes which helps or maybe my skin because my skin is a little bit texturized um a little bit textured so yeah maybe it's just my skin but i just want this i highly recommend this product to anybody that's trying to maintain clear skin because it's just deep pore cleansing and when your pores are clean there's no bacteria, there's no pimples coming, there's no blemishes. So yeah, I highly recommend it along with the anti-blemish pads.